Verify exists to fact check the suspicious post you read online and get you the truth. As clashes between police and protesters continue, some people are sharing this tip online. If you get hit with pepper spray, mix water and baking soda and then spray it on your face to stop the burning. But will this do it yourself treatment really work? Let's take a closer look. To get the answer, our researchers contacted experts in chemistry, dermatology and poison control and looked at information from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Chris Kramer is the vice president for research and professor of chemical theory and computation at the University of Minnesota. He says there's no evidence the baking soda solution would work. That's because the active ingredient in pepper spray is not an acid. It's capsaicin, the heat producing compound in chili peppers. Kramer says capsaicin is oil based, so it won't even dissolve in water. Our other experts agree. They say not only is there no evidence it would work, but it could also be dangerous. So when somebody is sprayed with pepper spray, they their eyes are irritated. They might be rubbing their eye. And if something small in particular, like baking soda, gets in the eye, that can make the irritation worse and actually lead to more serious injury, like even a corneal abrasion or a corneal ulcer. Dr. Adam Friedman, chair of dermatology at the George Washington University School of Medicine and Health Sciences, says using baking soda this way could even cause an alkaline burn. So we can verify false. Experts say using baking soda and water is not an effective way to neutralize pepper spray. Our experts and the CDC suggest using soapy water on your skin and irrigating your eyes with water instead. If there's something you want to verify researchers to look into, just email the whole team, verify at WUSA9.com.